The museum is filled with condemnations of the museum. The collection is filled with condemnations of the collection. Almost everything tells you about the sins of European colonialism, European racism. There are, of course, all of the nods to the religion of our time. There are segments on beyond the binary, because I'm sure that's what everybody wants when they go to the Pitt Rivers collection. And we see, for instance, anime characters from the 1990s who are strong queer icons. Uh, my point is that the museum is effectively abolishing itself. What I think is strange is that they should hate the collections which they are in charge of. Again, I come back to the point, I followed, unlike Ed, extremely closely the activities of the Tate in recent years, and also observed extremely closely the way in which they decided to make Stanley Spencer, one of the other two great artists of the 20th century, in their collection into a posthumous racist for no good reason at all. It is in your hands for your generation to pass on to the next.